Well guys, it is March break and while most of us are still used to being on the ice, this morning Johnny and I are heading out on open water. Johnny, what's the plan buddy? Well, plan is to head over exactly where we were ice fishing two weeks ago and see if we can find these jumbos. Once we get into those, maybe uh, we'll see, you know. Lake Simcoe's got excellent fishery, lots to offer. So. On this episode, guys, we're going to be chasing down some Lake Simcoe jumbo perch. So let's see how it goes. Guys, the rod that I'm going to be using today is the St. Croix six foot four light action Avid. Still have to take the tag off and the Shimano Van Ford 2000 series reel. This combo is going to be extremely light, very, very sensitive. I have to piece it all together, add a little fluorocarbon leader, and then we're going to start to locate these perch on the electronics and see if we can catch any 13 14 inch jumbos so and johnny you're running the st croix triumph 66 light action uh paired with the daiwa fuego uh 2000 there great little reel great bang for the buck great bang for the buck so there you have it guys we're both going to be running uh six footers light action 2000 series reels and uh we found over the years that that is a winning combination. You could feel very light bites, it makes it extremely sensitive, and when they're sensitive, it makes for a lot of fun. So, you ready? Let's do it. Let's get to it. Guys, the action is non-stop today. Look at the size of these jumbos Look at this. Are coming in. Look at this. <laughs> it's like I've got a good fish on here. You got a good one on yeah, too? Yeah, I got a good one on. <laughs> and we're not punching holes. We're just Oh, just missed. We're just moving up on them. Yeah. Good one? Uh, not a jumbo. Good fish though. Good fish. Like that. That's cool. That is a jumbo. <laughs> what are you talking about? It's <laughs> not a jumbo. You know what they're really liking today? Pepper shot. Pepper shot. I, I made that change. And uh ah, you saw I was I was uh, on a hot streak there. You got it. Show the camera that fish, Mono. So I noticed Gallo was getting the bigger fish on the pepper shad. So guys, when you're fishing with your buddies, don't be stubborn. Make the change. I made the change to the pepper shad. Right Look away. Look at that right there. Yeah. Immediately. That's why we come to Simcoe. <laughs> See? There you go, guys. Was yours on the pepper shed? Yes. So was mine. Yeah. one we'll keep that one yeah there you go 
There you go. There we go. So that fish right there would be below the average size of what we're catching. Way below. That's a small that's a small one compared to what we're catching. So that, and that's ultimately why you come out in the spring. There we go. Oh, that's a good one. Yeah. That is, look at the colors on that. That is yellow perch at its finest. sitting in 22 feet of water they are really hunkered down to bottom and the technique is very simple cast it out let that pencil weight hit bottom and slowly pop it back and retrieve the slack it's very very easy very effective when you retrieve the slack keeps tension on the line there you go you feel every single bite another 11 inch perch beautiful thick belly the uh, the apprentice minnow never disappoints now mono what a lot of people don't know is the amount of time that we go through with the prototyping stages of those colors that we release hey mono every color that gets put out is a guaranteed to catch fish on different bodies of water, different water clarities. It's been tested. We test them extensively. Tea stained water, clear water, uh, silt colored water, shield lakes, sand bottom. They're extensively tested. If they don't produce fish for us, the colors don't get released. It's as simple as that. So there's another cast. Back, pick up the slack. Oh. Mono. And not not for nothing, buddy, but you look at the boats that are around us. Yeah. There's one. And uh, I don't know what they're using, <laughs> but they'd be hooking up a lot more with the apprentice. Look at this, another. Look at this fish, Mono. Look. Oh, big boy. Look at this perch. <laughs> and it's like this every single cast. It's, it's, it's incredible. There you go. So, the pepper shad. It's incredible. You know, I love chasing big fish. Muskies, king salmon, you know, big walleye. Oh, yeah. But this, on the right tackle, yes. is so much fun. Yes. Six foot, six foot four, six foot six, light action, 1,000 or 2,000 series reel and uh light line and it is an absolute blast it is so much fun guys if you, want, if you wanted to introduce a kid to fishing oh that's a good fish this is the way to do it right non-stop action oh there you go so guys we want to share with you the tactic today that's been so successful on getting close to a one-man limit here on lake simcoe uh you want to practice selective harvest when you're out here you know, you definitely don't need to keep every fish that you catch. For us, it's just about having some, uh, you know, fish tacos, enjoying our catch with friends and family. But uh, this is the tactic today. So, Gallo, show them that fish you just brought in. Beauty. It's unbelievable. <laughs> it is non-stop action, guys. Not to interrupt the segment where we're going to share what we're using and our show, tackle. Show them exactly what just caught that nice jumbo. 
Guys, this is the blue collar. Apprentice Minnow, Pepper Shad is the color. Lights out. Lights out. So it's a drop shotting technique. We're running uh, light action rods, 1,000 or 2,000 series reels, quarter ounce pencil weight on the end, VMC spin shot hooks. So you can see it allows that bait to spin freely. And uh, yeah, these are the blue collar bait apprentice minnows. So that's a 2.25 inch split tail. And this particular color today, Pepper Shad has been lights out. So uh, we've well, had... it's a combination, not only of the colors that, you know, the team develops, but also the, uh, the scent. It's that proprietary scent, the fish bite, they hold on, they can't let it go. Yeah, and we, it's and, a winning combination. And, and guys, these are the same two baits that we put on this morning when we came out here. We've been fishing these all morning long. No need to change. The action is non stop. Non -stop. It's just back to back jumbo perch out here. So if you're thinking about getting out on Lake Simcoe, we confirm the ice is out. Get out here, bring your friends, bring your family. Have a great time. This is such a great fishery. Um, and the action today has been non-stop for us. Guys, it is always a pleasure. As always, good luck and stay safe out there.